Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Brushes and Mirror. Wish you all a very happy Bengali New Year and Shubho Koyla Vaishak to you all. Both are same. In case you have not come to know it, that's why I have said it in English and Bengali. I have said it in both languages. Now, before getting into the video, if you are watching me for the first time, then let me introduce myself. I am Trisha and here I create content related to beauty, skin care, makeup and fun challenges. So if you are interested in such kind of uh, content then do not forget to subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to hit the bell button so that you get notified every time I post something. Also for more update please follow me on Instagram. My Instagram ID is given in the description box so please go and check it out. And for my regular viewers thanks a lot for the love and support you all show to me every time. And video ke title se aap sab ko pata chali gaya hoga aaj ke video ka topic. So in this video I have created this look जो कि आपको आगे वीडियो में देखने को मिलेगा कि कैसे मैंने ये लुक क्रिएट किया है एंड दिस लुक स्पेशली फॉर द स्पॉइलर बॉय शेफ पर्पस एंड इट इज अ वेरी ब्यूटीफुल एलिगेंट एंड ट्रेडिशनल लुक और इस लुक को आप डे टाइम नाइट टाइम कभी भी आप इस लुक को क्रिएट कर सकते हैं और इस लुक को ना ही पॉयला वर्षा के लिए आप इस लुक को हल्दी फंक्शंस या कोई भी डे टाइम सेरिमनीज में भी आप इस लुक को क्रिएट कर सकते हैं सो नाउ विदाउट वेस्टिंग मच ऑफ योर टाइम लेट्स गेट क्विकली इनटू द वीडियो और वीडियो में जाने से पहले और एक चीज मैं आप सबको बता दूं वीडियो में मैंने स्किन प्रिपरेशन नहीं दिखाया है क्योंकि यू ऑल नो व्हाट एवर स्किन केयर प्रोडक्ट आई यूज सो फॉर नाउ आई हैव नॉट चेंज एनी ऑफ माय स्किन केयर प्रोडक्ट अगर मैं आगे कभी फ्यूचर में स्किन केयर प्रोडक्ट चेंज करूंगी देन आई एल अपडेट यू ऑल सो आई हैव स्किप्ड द स्किन केयर पोर्शन एंड आई हैव डायरेक्टली मूव्ड इनटू द मेकअप सो डू नॉट फॉरगेट टू प्रिप योर स्किन बिफोर यू अप्लाई एनी काइंड ऑफ मेकअप You can see that my skin is totally clean and prepped so for my base I'll be applying a CC cream and the CC cream I'm applying is from Lakme and I'm in the shade Beach. I have dotted the CC cream on my entire face. Then using a wet beauty blender I have blended the CC cream all over my face and also when you are applying a CC cream or foundation like whenever you are applying your base don't forget to apply it on your ear and on your neck areas too. Then to conceal my under eyes and the darker areas of my face I have used a concealer from NY Bay in the shade Grander Than Central. I wanted to keep my base very light so I did not go uh, over the board with my concealer. Then again I have blended it using the same wet beauty blender. Now to set my base I have used a compact powder from Lakme. I have applied a very little amount of powder using a round fluffy brush and I have applied it only on my T-zones and on my under eyes. Then I did a very little contouring using a brown eyeshadow which I usually do. Contouring or bronzing is totally optional for this look. You can uh, skip if you want to. Now 
after contouring i have applied some blusher and the blusher i have applied is from swiss beauty it is the baked blusher and highlighter and i'm in the shade 03 and the best part about this uh, blusher is it is uh, not matte it is a bit into shimmery side you can skip a uh, highlighter if you are applying this blusher i have also applied some blusher on my chin and nose And now it's time to do my eyes and first I'm going to do my eyebrows and you can see that my eyebrows are already groomed. So I have taken a angular brush and on that I took some amount of brown eyeshadow and with that I'm just filling the sparse areas of my eyebrows. repeating the same process for my other eyebrow now taking the skin toned eyeshadow first i am gonna set the base of my eyelids this is gonna help me to get a smooth canvas for my eyeshadow here i have used the eyeshadow palette from morphe it is the jaclyn hill palette Then from the same palette I took this brownish orange shade on a round fluffy brush and I have applied it on my crease line and this is also going to be my transition shade. I have applied the same eyeshadow on my lower lash line too. Then on a small flat eyeshadow brush I took both this yellow eyeshadow and applied it on my lid and this eyeshadow is from Marvelous Matte palette from Makeup Revolution. Then again I have applied the same eyeshadow on my lower lash line too. Then again I took the round blending brush to merge both the eyeshadows well. Then on a flat eyeshadow brush I took this shimmery golden shade and applied it on the inner corner of my eyelids. I have blended both the golden and the yellow eyeshadow together and also I have applied it on my lower lash line too. This is how my eyeshadow has turned out. For my upper lash line I have not used any kind of liquid eyeliner. In place of it I have drawn a wing using a brown and black eyeshadow with the help of a small angular brush. First I have drawn the wing using a dark brown eyeshadow and then I have intensified it using a black eyeshadow. This is the first time I have tried something like this and I am happy that it has turned out well. The last thing to complete my eye makeup is some mascara so I have loaded my eyelashes with a lot and lots of mascaras. And the mascara I have applied is from Maybelline. It is the Hyper Curl Volume Express Mascara and it is one of the favorite mascara I have used till now. In this look, I have not applied any kind of eye pencil for my waterline. I have just applied some mascara on my lower lash line too.
to highlight my brow bone i have applied the same golden shimmery eyeshadow which i have applied in the inner corner of my eyelids then i have applied some highlighter on the bridge of my nose on my cupid bow chin forehead and on my cheekbones For lipstick I have used a lipstick from Lakme. It is the Lakme 9 to 5 primer plus cream lipstick in the shade Pink Affair. And this is how the entire look has turned out. So this was it. I hope you all have enjoyed watching the video. If you do then like the video and share it with your friends and families and I'll be back with another interesting video. Until next time stay safe. Take care. Bye bye.